Alright guys, this is Mithril, back with a brand new Skyrim video, we're continuing going off. Uh, let's see, a dragon just attacked right near Whiterun, so we're going to a meeting. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But Not I really. I've forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for Faringar. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property in the city. And please, accept this gift from my personal army. If you come along, I would very... Hide bracers and... I almost never pickpocket. Afford to risk both of you. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. As you command. All right, uh, Irileth, I'll meet you there. This isn't a death or glory mission. I need to know what we're dealing with. Don't worry, my lord. I'm the very soul of caution. All right, Irileth, I'll meet you there. I hope you guys are liking the new Skyrim videos, I have to say. Granted, there's only been one out so far during the time of this video, you know, being recorded. But man, doesn't it look so nice? Is it this rock or the next rock? Uh, next rock? Okay. Is it T? Yep. No signs of any dragon right now. I don't see any dragon either. It looks like he's dangerous. I know it looks bad. What gave it away? The fire? What happened? And if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere, set out. Look for survivors. We need to know what. All right, let's go looking for it. But honestly, who goes looking for a giant lizard that can breathe fire? Seen any dragons? No, get back. It's still here somewhere. Rocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Yeah, quickly. Uh oh. Why did he go over the mountain, I wonder? Nope, nothing up here other than probably death. Come on, land. Need you to land. Guess that's landing. Yeah, how do you like fire yourself? I need you to land flat on the ground. Okay, time to level up. Health for sure. Oh, I'm gonna give myself a little stamina. And let's see. I'm gonna give myself more one-handed. Uh, I guess.
Come on, dragon, land like on the ground. I'm trying not to get eaten. Oh my. Well, um, who dies to the first dragon? Am I right? Sorry about that. I hit my. Up filter. Yeah, uh, who dies to the first dragon? Wish I had some help here, but everyone was like shooting arrows or marshmallows at him or something. That's embarrassing. Just keep hitting everything now. Let's stay, but if he comes again. Come on, land on the ground. Where is he going? Perfect. Guys, if anyone wants to play like, you know, aggro. died again steel arrows I guess gold no it's cool how they added the uh, guard thing like to his stomach I can actually carry him Nice, now I have a shout. Don't know how to use it though. Oh, Z. I can't believe it. You're Dragonborn. Dragonborn? What do you mean? In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the Dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. Uh, I don't know what happened to me. Well, you can shout now. You couldn't before, right? 
That can only mean one thing. You must be Dragonborn. Dragonborn? What are you talking about? That's right. Well, that is interesting. Oh my god. That's kind of annoying in this game that I found out. When there's missions that need to go up to Dragon's Reach, they get rid of the map marker. Do not know why. Look, you already have been told you. They say Helgen got hit by Turn a dragon. Around and go back the way you came. We're causing no trouble. All we have is You know, notice how that in that shout that they did, it was Dove, uh, Keen, not Dova Keen. Because Dova Keen does mean Dragonborn, but Dove is Dragon, and I think, uh, it's like Hunter, and then obviously Keen is like Born, so technically your name's like Dragon Hunter Born, or something to that effect. I don't know. Put it down in the comment section if I'm wrong, or if I'm right. But, you know, You're either way. Here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? Yeah, da, 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 da. yep. The Watchtower is destroyed, but we killed the dragon. I knew I could count on Irileth. But there must be more to it than that. Turns out I may be something called Dragonborn. Dragonborn? What do you know about the Dragonborn? When the dragon died, I absorbed some kind of power from it. So it's true. The Greybeards really were summoning you. The Greybeards? Question mark. Masters of the Way of the Void. They live in seclusion high on the slopes of the throat of the world. What do these Greybeards want with me? The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thune. A thune. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeard. This is his brother Did right you here. Hear the thundering sound as you return to Whiterun. That was the voice of the Greybeards summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tiber Septim himself. Was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rungar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Nord he nonsense? I don't see any signs of him being this, what, dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Yeah, you tell him. Rungar, don't be so hard on Avanish. I meant no disrespect, of course. Lies. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeards' business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. Well, I mean, technically. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place, very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. <sighs> no matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I may be the Bane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal house carl. All right, and Lydia. Okay. From my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Poventus. All right, thank you, thank you. Defend. Let's see, this foreign guard take dragon ingredients? On 
bed. Not in here. Oh, there he is. It seems this damnable. Hmm. I had you figured for a mage. I think you'll appreciate this. Does not look like it. It might be nice to have a familiar, though. I mean, I will have Lydia, but you never know. If I could afford it. Got the app. Now, how do you F? Okay. While in game, press Q to open the favorites menu, which allow you to. Okay. Anti press like one. Q. All right. Favor that. And. And then I'll favorite this that way. Let's see. Goes right, and that goes left. Like this. Okay. Oh, and then here's Lydia. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. Follow me. Lead the way. Everyone knows Lydia, the OG. I mean, who doesn't know her? She's sworn to carry my burden. It's a shame, isn't it? All right, but before we go anywhere, we gotta go to uh, what's his name, Balathor, Balath, Balathair, something like that. Well met, kinsman. Oh, Balathor, there we go. I was close. Look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. Everything's for sale, my. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. All right, let's see. What can I sell this guy? You can have this terrible axe. You can have one of the swords. We'll keep the steel because you know Imperial suck. Nope, that's not what I meant to do. You can have that. I'll keep these for now. You can have that nonsense. And then thanks for your time. Now, what to do? Because usually, I go to the stables, and then I go to White, or I was going to call it White Run, Riften, and then I just run all the way over here. Or should I go from Hell again, go through here, and around? Eh. We'll go to Riften. Take you to where do you want to go? Where is Rift? There you go, 20 gold. Back and we'll be off. 20 gold to go that far? Isn't Rift in like never been to Rift. four days? Sure to visit the Black Briar Technically, you know, like in the universe, if you want, like canon. Alright, I got this down. Now let's run on over. Man, now that I'm not in the fight with the dragon, I regret not putting any in stamina. Kind of misty here. Oh, I don't even have enough magic. 
energy cup for it. Oh no. Bought a spell I can't even use. Luckily I didn't use it in actual combat. Where's this dog? Once I level up, I'm gonna have to put one in conjuration, I guess. What is your guys' favorite part of Skyrim? Like, what's your favorite region? Because most of it, you know, is, like, supposed to be cold and stuff. I don't mind, you know, the Valkyrie area and the Riften area where there's, like, no snow. I don't mind that. Because pretty much all the, on the top and stuff, yep, yeah, that's yeah, snow. not oh no rock joint man I backhand it and then I came from the overhead oh my god another Enemy, what is it this time? Oh, it was a bandit, but a, a horse took it out. Oh, I thought I was a gunner just now. Thanks for the help. And if you need any supplies, I didn't really help you, but okay. Way to go, peddler. Show that bandit who's boss. Down tree. Serethi farm. Okay. We should be almost there. Howdy. Yep, vigilance Stendor. I think you might be sick. I am actually can they he heal me? Bloated with his Please cure me. Light purify you of your ills. Ah. Uh, None escape the vigil. All must be fate that I met them here. You know, I didn't ask in the last episode, but do you guys ever play um survival in Skyrim? I've never done it. Maybe I should have done it for this. Maybe I should wait one day if I ever, like, live stream this. You know, like a new playthrough. Hmm. Just things to think about, I guess. Alright, well we got here pretty much no difficulty.
There it is, the first of the so-called 7,000 steps. Now, fun fact, not really uh, 7,000 steps up. Somebody counted. Can't remember who, and I don't remember how many steps. But I'll probably look it up after this and then put it on the screen. Maybe even in the comment section down below. There's also a unique hidden thing. I can't remember if it's like a perk for a little while, whatever. But if you read all these edge tablets as you walk on up, you'll get something special. Oh my god, I got rock joint again. God dang rock joint, why is it so freaking potent? Like, I know this is supposed to be some sort of, like, Nord pilgrimage, but... Who would want to do this? Walk up this huge mountain, go to the Greybeards at uh, High Hrothgar, and then be like, Nope, sorry. We know you walked all the way up here, but we're not going to let you in. Because I don't think they let people in. More wolves. Once again with the backhand overhead. Even more wolves. Is Lydia, like, not following me? Where the heck is she? Oh man, look at that. Something like that. Ooh. I could just get the UI out of the way. That'd be a good screenshot. Here is one of the first true enemies of the game. It's a little further ahead, but it's close to here. Anyone who has played Skyrim knows. quickly wait an hour to have an auto save that way at the very least if I something were to happen to me it won't be too far away oh it's right up in here right up here did you make sure you were following me Where is he? Oh, there he is. There he is, the first true boss of the game, the Frost Troll. Trolls are weak to fire. I mean, look at that thing. It freaking took on me and Lydia at the same time. I don't know, but now it's regenerating.
As long as I keep its regen to a minimum. Is this a little cheaty? Yes. Do I care? No. As long as it works. Just like that. The first true boss of the game. Defeated. If I was better at editing, I'd put in the Dark Souls boss defeated. They're just around that corner. <sighs> Only my stamina was better. said around this corner I mean around this corner uh, there it is see I only tell truths no lies Tyber Septum himself not even the graveyards can't help but respect him anything in the chest always empty I'll take that. And the rest of the stuff, man. Pretty much just flowers. So, the dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the air. Uh, I'm answering your summons. Show us, Dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. What button was it again, Z? Dragonborn, it is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. I am Master Angir. I speak On for gear. the radiance. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? Uh, let's see. I want to find out what it means to be dragonborn. We are here to guide you in that pursuit. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the dragon blood that came before you. You mean I'm not the only dragonborn? You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether you are the only dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. All right, I'm ready to learn. You have shown that you are dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? That remains to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first step towards Voice into a Lydia, can you please get out of the way? Yeah, 
Yeah, there we go. Finally. Sorry, I'm making a mess of your place. Don't mean it. Well done. Again. Idiot once again in the way. Don't give me that look. You learn quickly. Oh, so really? Todd Howard. This is boring. Yeah, sorry about the pot. Okay, my guy. A lot faster. Nice and bright out here, at least. You will now see how you learn a completely new chant. Master Bori will teach you wood, which means well done. Okay. Why not just teach me like every word you know? Please do. Okay, bow, bowing of the head again. Thank you. Funny story about this. I'll tell you in a second once he stops talking. Master Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. Then it will be your turn. So the Okay, hold on. So the very first time I've Oh he's interrupting me, okay. So anyways, first time I've ever played Skyrim, no idea how to change shouts, no idea what I was doing. So basically what I had to do was sometime or sometime somehow sprint through this. Not whirlwind sprint, just regular old sprinting like this to do it, because I didn't know how to change shouts. Quick mastery of a new thum is uh, astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself. I don't know how to do it, it just happens. You were given this gift by the gods for a reason. It is up to you to determine how best to use it. You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jorgen Windcaller, our founder, 
from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrad. Remain true to the way of the voice. Okay, achievement unlocked, the way of the voice. But uh, anyways, you guys, I'm going to end it here for today. If you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like, comment, maybe even subscribe. Do or don't, it's up to you. Can't make you do anything you don't want to do. But uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Alright, so uh, this is Mithril, signing out. Bye-bye.